Hello everyone, welcome to our first lesson. Uh, this will be a night Friday circuit we are going to create from Python to the Cyber PI. So this will be our basic first lesson. First of all, you need to open a Visual Studio Code Editor. And if you don't know, please uh, go and watch my previous video intro to the Cyber PI. I will show everything how to uh, create uh, the development environment to start from the cyber pi so this will be our first lesson after the introduction so first what you need to do is you need to install the packages you go to here and go to new terminal in here we type pip pip install cyber pi so this is the package we need to install to create Python coding so we enter so I already install uh, the packages so I already satisfied so I don't see any issues if you installing first time it will show you uh, it's installing so make sure your firewall is not blocking anything and uh, uh, you are connected to the internet and should be successful without installing the cyber pi you cannot do anything make uh, make sure that now after that what you need to do here is we create a folder in here i already created a folder cyber pi and next i'm going to create a, a new file i'm going to say um this is essence one okay so now let's get started. We're going to see import um, time. Okay, we put import time, our first one. And after that, we're going to say import cyber pi. Uh, I think I should put a comment. Uh, so everyone can understand what I'm doing here. Me. I'm going to use here is uh, importing the time and uh, cyber pi module. Related operations. Okay, so we import in the time and cyber PM related operations. Okay, next, what I'm going to do here is uh, hold on, let me. all the questions next I'm going to uh, LED count you know what why we I'm going to delete this I'm going to show you I'm going to change the light because this is uh, already configured so I need to uh, I'm going to do something here cyber PI LED get on uh, I'm going to change to this to green okay and I'm going to show you how to run so this is the run command in here so once you run it's all importing the cyber PI module related operations so now it's doing great okay now you can see it's green so now we are running we are not in uh, uploading the code we just only running the code so it will effect like this once you upload the code it will be permanent and every time when you plug in it will work okay now 
that's how we change uh, any light. I mean, we can change to any color, then the Cyber PI is going to change it. Okay. So next, uh, now let's start our code, import time. Okay. Now we're going to create the Night Rider circuit uh, light, LED light effect. Count. I'm going to use eight. And next is LED brightness. Ten. And we're going to start our loop while true. And close it. We can say four. I. We're going to use only one color for the night rider effect. Dt. Uh, it's already popular. It's very easy. Uh, look, the Visual Studio Code editor. You will give you a summarize what we are typing. What that code do. So I don't need to explain. So you can you know read it and can get to know what we're doing the mega block python editor you don't get those stuff so that's why i wish to code code editor is you know it's good it's advanced we're going to use cyber pi led and we're going to say on and we can say red and after that, I'm going to use ID because we choose I. So, and next we're going to use time and sleep. We're going to use the time parameter 0 0.05. Okay, delay execution for given number of seconds. So, next. I'm going to use cyber PI to LED and off. I'm going to use ID and one. Okay, ID one is successful. And now next is I'm going to use the four I in. I'm going to say range. I'm going to say LED. Uh, you can see LED count. Use that option. Uh, I'm not going to close this because I need to type some stuff here. One. Okay, I'm going to use the zero minus one. I'm going to close Cyber PI. I will explain everything later as I type LED on. Okay, and I'm going to use red again. So remember, this is a loop. If you see my embed Neo lessons, I, I explain everything. So this is nothing to do with the embed neural lessons. This is on, uh, everything related to the cyber PI and all the cyber security. We're going to do projects in the future. Okay. And we're going to use time slip. We're going to close the brackets and we're going to say 0 0.05 is the delay execution. And we're going to say cyber PI LED off. Uh, I'm going to say ID. Okay, we almost done with the done with the code. Okay, that's that's all we need to type for the LED effect. Uh, actually, nitride effect. Now I'm going to delete everything, and I'm going to run. So in here in the button run current find interactive window. So that's we're going to run. Okay. So we can see LED is working. I want to see 
I want to make sure I'm not missing anything now. Okay, guys, I found out that what's the issue is. So um, actually, I mistakenly typed number one. It should come uh, I. So that's why I was I was got confused. What I'm missing, I couldn't find it out, figure it out. But typo mistake, it happened. But you need to make sure you don't do that. It's going to waste your time. So now you can see when I type one, it's not going to work like this. I don't want to see like this. I want to see now. I changed I and I I, I, I also doing a space in here too. So let me. See now it's working. That's how it need to run. So now we are running on live mode. That's why it's slow. Once we upload, it's going to be fast. Now let me copy this, and I'm going to uh, switch back to. I'm going to first stop here. Uh, interrupt. Clear all. You know, sometimes when you move to the other uh, editor, you probably will get issues. So probably it's, uh, unplug and plug it back the Cyber PI. It should work after that. So I'm going to do a connect. Successful. I'm also going to run and see how it does. See now it's a live mode and it's working. So now we need to do like upload and see how fast when once we upload the code to the I'm going to stop and I'm in the upload and in the middle bar click upload um, yeah I don't know what is this thing stories <laughs> it seems like it's working fine so this is how you create a night rider uh, LED light from Visual Studio code editor and upload through make a block editor and I will see you on your next lesson and I'm going to give you a more a little bit advanced okay so please subscribe to my channel and don't miss any videos and I'll see you on my next video. Thank you for watching.